What are you doing on the side of the fucking street playing with your imaginary friends doll? Hello sunshines and welcome to my current household of June. So I am currently here in my household with my personal gameplay. So my current household. Now I've played this current household ever since I built my new PC or this PC. And that was back in, I want to say February. So I've been playing this for a good, like, what is it now? Like four months i think now in those four months i have played five generations five generations oh my god i can't count i started off with rose jones her i think maiden name was swan if i was right she lived in riverview and she married married aiden jones who at the time was already married to somebody and had a child named galen so we kind of you know married into that now they had two children together um, amelia and ethan ethan i don't know a lot about because he was born when they were already quite old and I never really played with them i moved on to amelia jones now amelia was married you can see it right now let me see <laughs> with uh, uh allison to allison allison was a townie I want to say in Riverview, I believe. I don't know. I think she already got together with her in Riverview and then they moved to Moonlight Falls together. And there Allison became a fairy. Now, eventually I, you know, removed the fairy occult from her because she was just getting so old and hope their daughter was just not like older almost than her mother so it, it was just a weird weird vibe now the third generation as i mentioned was hope and hope had four children now with hope i kind of focus on island paradise because i haven't really explored that pack all too much so she had four children and they are called sailor river ariel and Eaten. Now they are all kind of ocean and water related names because we were living in the paradise. So I thought that was I, I thought that just fit. Now Hope was married to Penny, who sadly literally just had passed away. Has passed away. It is so sad. They went out for a little dinner date and she just died during that. It was so sad. It was honestly so extremely sad. But I moved on with River, who has now the last name of Frio, because she married Connor Frio, who you might know from Sunset Valley. I almost said Sardu Valley, what the fuck? Now, River with River, I'm kind of focusing more on generations, and, well, just basically kind of chilling, having a lot of kids, as you can see, and just uh, just moving on. Now, as you can see, she's already a grandparent because lovely, lovely Skylar, the first official born, they are twins, but she came out first, you know. She had a baby, literally, I think yesterday in game, when she was still a teen. She was on the verge of aging up. She had only two days to go when she got pregnant. So she wasn't that young, I guess, when she got a baby, but she was still like 18, I think, you know. She was still 18. Now she is currently dating Sam. We have Ayla and we have Layla, which I did not do on purpose. I just forgot I already named something someone Ayla or Ayla. I don't know how you pronounce it, honestly. We have Blake, who is the twin brother of Layla and we, or Lila, I don't know. And we have Luna who is the twin sister of Esther, who I still need to age up today because it is her birthday, just like her sister's was. Yay. Okay, so basically that is a very short summary of what is currently going on in the Frio household. Uh, there is a sale going on, very nice. So yeah, it is kind of crazy. We also have two pets. As you can see, I have way too fucking many people in my household. I was thinking of already... Oh god, the imaginary friends call so much like. I swear to god, I regret doing that. Is the baby okay? Yeah, she's fine. He's fine. Oh my god. But she also immediately got a wish to get married. The second. The second that she went ahead and had a baby. Which was still in her teenage years. 
Oh my god, the second my fucking teenagers or my children grow up to a teenager, this fucking person show up. It is so fucking annoying, honestly. But again, what I was trying to say, everybody is here! But she immediately got the wish to get married. So I interpret that, that she kind of wants to move out and move in with her boyfriend. But anyway, I don't really know what to tell you. Uh, today is leisure day, I believe. That uh, You can... Um, oh my god, fuck. <laughs> yeah, and it's leisure day. I didn't know for a second where I could find that. So Blake right here will be my next heir to next generation in which I will be focusing to late night. Now Blake literally just aged up to a teen. Oh fuck, I need to age her up. Where is she? Oh my god, where? Where is Esther? What are you doing here? Girl, what are you doing on the side of the fucking street playing with your imaginary friends doll? What's happening? Okay, she is going to bike all the way over, which is, oh my god, it's literally all the way over here. Oh, she wants to see Ayla get married. So they are currently young adults. Now, I want to find a love interest for Ayla because she has none currently. Because there were no female... What are... Excuse me, don't fight with your grandmother. She's on the fucking verge of dying. Look at her. She's literally seven days too old. So she's gonna fall, drop dead any any moment. But uh, she wants to go to Egypt. She wants to join a medical career, which is fine. She was literally in her... You're so hungry. Why are you not eating? Can I ask? Can I ask why nobody's taking care of themselves? Uh, you are taking care of yourself. I need to pause this. He wants to see her become a doctor. Which is honestly kind of great because she wants to become a doctor. Do you have the wish? No, of course not. You're, You're the family-oriented family one, one, but you don't, don't have, have the, the wish. wish. Why would you? Oh, oh my god, this is so weird. Layla, you're like 15 years old. Maybe older. Maybe like 16. That is so weird. Okay, you need to take care of yourself. Uh, we do have a maid because if you can see how fucking huge this house is, I can maintain that on that. Like, I have so many sims. They make everything dirty every day. Okay, so uh, you are also not taking care of yourself. And I am not entirely sure why. Please take care of yourself. You're just painting. She's always painting in her parents' room. It's kind of weird. But you know, you go off, I guess. Uh, luckily, everybody else is kind of fine. The baby is doing okay. He's gonna need his diaper changed. I do want to move Skylar out. Probably right now. I still need to have Esther's birthday. But we will do that when she's oh she is home oh look at that that was actually pretty fast okay let's just do that right now i don't feel like buying her a cake i'm so sorry i've had literally four birthdays four give me probably should have had her aged up on the side of the road because now everybody's gonna cancel out what they're doing yay i really like that um please don't please please just everybody who needs to do something please just do it Honestly, I could not be bothered right now. <laughs> We've had so many birthdays. I cannot be bothered anymore. Oh my god, Blake, no. Okay, she's aging off. Fuck, I don't want to miss it. <laughs> okay, she had a very success in school. She was in boarding school, actually, for her, her entire, entire childhood. I brought her home when she was a teen. She's gonna be a computer whiz. Okay, sure, sure, that's fine. I'm not gonna... How does she look? Oh! Oh, I think she's pretty cute. Most of my children are pretty okay looking, actually, if I say so myself. If I say so myself, they're pretty okay. Oh, I forgot to mute the music. Oh, when it gets loud, you can't do that anymore. So that is kind of annoying. Okay, so let's just give her a little makeover. Oh, she's cute, actually. I had a few. Oh, wow, she's really pretty. Only her nose is a little flat. They all really do have inherited kind of the same genetics. It's either all River or all Connor. I really like this hair on her. Oh, I accidentally clicked it. Oh no. I didn't mean to click it. Oh no. Okay. Uh, I really like this hair on her. It looks cute. I don't know if I've given it to, given it to Sims before. She did inherit, like, I think Connor's eyes as well. River has more blue eyes, I believe. I honestly don't know my Sims genetics. Like, you could honestly. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I have uninstalled 900 pieces of custom content. <laughs> um, uh, a few, a few, uh, a few days ago. I don't know what our favorite color is. Wait, I'm trying to remember. 
Was it or no? It wasn't. Was it green? Oh my god! I totally forgot what her favorite color is. I haven't played. Yeah, it is green. I haven't played with her at all because she went to boarding school. But honestly, yeah, I I just it might seem very rude that I sent her off to boarding school, but I've honestly never used that feature before. So I just wanted to try it out. So it's honestly not that rude. <laughs> I think she was just a unlucky one. She also called a call to home like, please, can I go home? I don't want to be here. And I literally said, no, you have to stay there. Because she called one of the like, she called her twin sister, I believe. She called Luna, which is a little bit weird. But maybe she was just really scared. She was like, Luna, please, can you ask mom and dad to come that, that I can't come home? They were were on a holiday. They had like free vacation thingy at that time, so I couldn't, you know, a child can make that decision for her. Sure, give her this. It's not winter anyway. It's probably gonna be winter when she ages up to a young adult, so it's not that big of a deal. Not right now, at least. We're not gonna see it for a hot minute anyway. Probably in fall. Probably should have adjusted that. Who cares? Uh, I'm not gonna adjust her room right now because I have other things to do. Please eat. For the love of God. Please. Okay. Okay, we can stop. Hope, you can stop. Stop. Even a maid is still... Oh my God. I swear to God. Can you please eat something? Jesus, Blake. Today, please. Have you eaten? Yeah, you have. Okay. I want to go out with Ayla and maybe go out to the summer festival. See if anybody is there. Now, I just have a feeling that there are barely any female young adult sims in here. So I might go ahead and check that if I can. We can probably just head over to the summer festival with Ayla and just... Oh no, the baby is crying. It has pooped its pants. Oh no. Now, Ayla, there you go. Had, did she ever learn to drive? I think so. I did. <laughs> I did teach her that. So yeah, this whole save file, kind of crazy, kind of bloated. But you know, I'm having fun with it. Okay, we just stopped right into another car. Okay, now, who is going to be your victim? Who are you? Why do you have numbers in your name? Cyclone? That's kind of weird. Who are you? Aw, oh, Kaylin Langrag. She's kind of cute. How old is she? How about you just go ahead and do a friendly introduction? We'll just ask her how... Okay, okay, okay. You can stop running. You can stop running. It's okay. You can stop doing that. Who is this? Uh, Mirage. Oh, it's a little dog. Max. Max. N Max. <laughs> that was Dutch. Max Nali. That is probably the dog of her aunt, I want to say. She doesn't know her, I think. Oh, Ella. There you go. That is... Oh, no. That is not me. She's not even related to her anymore, I think. But she's married to Ian. And I think... I'm pretty sure... What, what the fuck? Did she just quit that? Did you just cancel that out? That's honestly so rude of you. This was her, right, Kaylin? Yeah. She might be a little bit older than her, which I don't mind that much. There is a hot dog eating contest going on right now. Oh, this is the guy, Elon. Ian. Elon? What? Ian Nolly, which uh, Ella has married. Did I not tell her to take care of the baby? And she just did not. Oh my god. Why are you working out? I get it. You just gave birth, but you actually have to take care of the baby. Oh my god. Go change his diaper. Jesus. The rest of them, I don't really care what they're gonna do. I honestly don't. Oh my god. This is so annoying. Why is she playing chess? Oh my god. Oh, also, I found out why my Sims was working so terribly. It was because it was not on my direct SSD card. So it was on my second memory drive on my hard drive and that one is kind of old honestly just fuck you who is this jamie jelena how about you go create the celebrity isn't aren't you also a celebrity yeah you're also like a level one celebrity is she cute the makeup choice is uh it's a choice oh wait who's this how about you just do a friendly introduction you're here already so what is this is this an easter egg oh it's an unknown uncommon seed oh, that's interesting uh did i give her the no i did not i feel like she would definitely need the observant thingy so that she learns the traits more quickly because she is a friendly sim i just feel oh and she's irresistible which is great which is honestly good uh, how about you just ask about her age right away after you pick it? She has really blonde hair. I would love to have that in my genetics. 
We haven't had blonde hair ever since Ella, what I was going to say. Ella had blonde hair, which was weird because her parents both had black hair, I believe. Yeah, they both had black hair, which was kind of odd. But there's a like 10% chance. Oh, the main is done. There's oh, they do not get along. They do not get along. Oh, she's only one day older though. I honestly think that is too a chance. Can you just um I just I just want to you to consider his attractiveness. Ayla learned that Kayada is A. She, she's A. Oh, okay. But I'm pretty sure I asked for her attractiveness. Who's this? Tamara Sword. Did the town populate new <laughs> new women? Because I have never Oh, she's already doing that. Okay. Well, she's already almost friends. Wait, 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 where's that girl? You're gonna leave, bitch, I swear to god, I will find you. Uh, one out of ten, okay. She's such a pain in the ass, honestly. She isn't attracted to anyone, anybody. Now, I understand because she was like a slob and she was disciplined. So, where did she go? Oh, there she, there she is, okay. So, I understand that, but still, how you doing? She's a perfectionist, she's neat, and she's good, oh, oh. So I feel like this could be this could be a potential. She is like okay looking. I would have loved to have like very blonde hair in my genetics though. She's 17 days older than her. Now I don't think that's a, that's a deal breaker necessarily because I mean she's still a young adult. How about you just ask if she's single? Oh Wait, she's in a relationship with that guy I saw here earlier. I don't think he's left though. Hmm. Can you just quickly consider her, her attractiveness? Just quickly. I just, oh, I just want her to find a love interest before she moves out. I don't want to play through a whole young adult life without a one out of ten. She does not. I have a feeling that she's like, what do you call it, asexual? Like she doesn't really like anybody or feel those kind of feelings i'm beginning to think that that is the problem this was such a flop honestly i just want her to find a nice girl to live with but i think i'm going to move them out um skylar with her boyfriend oh they actually have 10 out of 10 chemistry which is kind of, which is insane i do have a retuned attraction mod river has a lot of friends i believe a lot of old friends at least um yeah like ayesha she has michael ryan is still kind of family far away family she has paula she has madison Vic oh no and that was it but she has quite a few friends because she had a, a high level charisma also i can't click on my mailbox it does, doesn't exist but i also can't add a new one because it says i already have a thingy on my lot so that is honestly so annoying um can you just quickly go ahead and what open open what what <laughs> no oh my god please discover a potion i'm having so much trouble right now is sam here already no i invite him over that is Sam. Oh, it is. So I believe he should be on the same age aging cycle as Skylar is. I'm gonna quickly check uh, mass controller settings. Uh, no, no, that was not it. Intermediate age absolute. Yeah, he is on 12 right now. So I might just age him up right now. Trigger the age transition right here, right now. Uh, teach him to drive. <laughs> Oh, she can teach him to drive, and no, no, I don't think so, it's a little late for that. I do still need to have Layla and Blake be taught how to drive, so... Where is Connor? What is he doing today? What do you want to do? Enroll Esther? No! Connor, she just went to boarding school, you just you can't just send her away again. No. Why isn't the option there to teach her how to drive? Can I ask? Why is it there for- okay. Well, gee, you just do it then. I believe we have two cars though. Where's the other car? Who took the other car? Who is it? Oh, of course it's you. Of course it's you. You're not gonna take this car. That's your mom's car. You can't just take that. You can't just do that. Uh, where is Blake? Blake was discovering a potion or he was going to- Oh, wow. Oh, that is- oh god. That is a choice. I'm gonna have to quickly- Take him into cast, don't I? Yeah. Editing cast. Oh my god. He is a 
very cute sim. I aged up Bear. Oh, did I even show Bear yet? I think I did. I don't know. Did I? Did I show Bear? I don't know. But he's on Sam is honestly kind of a cute sim. Like, look at him. He's so cute. So I was so happy that they had only his lips are a little weird. I and mean, then he has kind of a snoz around him. He has a very small nose, but very wide. Like, extremely wide. It's kind of a... It's something. I think I have this hair on him. I don't know. It just makes him look so cute. I am going to put them in a cast so that they cannot break up. I don't know how to do that, but I know you can. So <laughs> I'm gonna do that. But yeah, I'm so glad my Sims is working properly again because oh, oh wait, this is actually very cute on him. I put this on him as a joke, but bro, I don't think it's a joke anymore. What is his favorite color? I think it was something like I think, I honestly think it was green or something, which would be perfect because Skylar's favorite color is also green. But I think it is, right? Yeah, it is green. Because it's funny, because in their prom photo together, I will show it in a minute, but in their prom photo together, they actually have the same color. So it kind of looks like they agreed to kind of match up for prom, which was so cute. Now, I obviously gave him that makeover, but I didn't really notice it until the prom photo. I just thought it was so adorable. I really am in desperate need of more male CC. Now, I reposted some on my Tumblr. I currently... Why is this listed for... Oh my god. Snatch, girl, snatch! <laughs> but I currently have uh i've started a cc oh that's cute a cc tumblr where i repose cc i downloaded or am going to download uh also fun thing to announce is that i am going to be streaming it again on saturday i will be proceeding my sims 2 plus view so i have fixed my sims 2 i did not know you could do that but somebody um actually commented on my VOD saying like oh you should download this or gigabyte patch and do this and this to make your game like run as good as new so i did that Suzel. and uh, you are not going to wear a t-shirt when you're going into the ocean that's kind of weird so yeah but if you want to stop by i will be streaming uh from 8 p.m central european time until about like what is it 11 so let's just go ahead and ask the full band what no just chat him up a little bit so I can add him to my household. Y'all can stop! Stop! Please stop! Stop! Oh, the baby is crying again. Oh my fucking god. Um, Connor, no, you're all busy. Hope? Uh, your great grandson. I can't believe she lived to see her great grandson. I can't believe. Yeah, really? Is he a young adult? You can. I could have literally done. Had Esther do it, but she doesn't give a shit about her little nephew. Very alluring. I don't want very alluring. I want to have sociable. No. He got a job while standing here. He got a job. We only know that he's excitable. Can I check his traits? Oh, he's artistic, brave. I know this is a weird way. Excitable. It's a very weird way. Uh, a sailor and a technophobe. Okay, he has good traits. He has very good traits. Very nice. Okay, so we're okay now. Uh, get to know him. Uh, ask about his day. But yeah, I did not realize my sims was running so badly because of the fact that it was not on my SSD, but it was on my HDD, so it was on my hard drive. I love that she's trying to cook for her family. That is so cute. Like, I love Luna. I haven't really played a lot with Luna because she was like, kind of the like, last set of twins and it was getting so chaotic. Please get sociable. I might just cheat him into my household at, at this point. I know I have more than eight. Oh my god, finally! Finally sociable. That took five. No, don't boast. <laughs> that took about 5,000 years. Please ask him to move in with you and then I'm going to move them out. I can't believe the first twins of my household are already moving out. He's taking quite a bit of money. That's kind of weird. Kind of weird for like such a young guy to take that much money. I believe she he will take about 20. 20,000? Yeah, they he brought $24,000. Uh, but where are you? I'm going to let her call and... Oh, uh, God, where do you do it? Where do you do it? Um, I can't find it. Real estate, move within... 
your household is not allowed to move at this time. What? Can you explain to me why not? What is the problem? Okay, well, there is no move in progress. Oh, because he is moving in. He wants to join a style. Wait, he wants to join a style. He wants to get married. Oh my god. Oh, I love that he's, but he is currently, he wants to be a stylist. So we should be able to move now. Uh, yeah, there you go. Nice, <laughs> so that was the problem. Okay, well, I'm sorry that I wanted to move out the second he moved in. I'm sorry for that. So yeah, but my household is getting so crowded and having two sims out of the way. It's just gonna be so good. Oh no, there are no houses. Oh no. Oh. Okay, well, I guess I will not move them out because there are no empty houses except for this one. Oh no. <laughs> they literally cannot move out. Okay, well. But I'm also gonna move out Ayla. And, but yeah, I will, I guess I will do that on my own because I'm gonna build them a little starter home then. Uh, and I won't do that on camera, but yeah. So I haven't really told a lot about Blake, but Blake is gonna be my heir for the look at him chomping on his little hot dog. Tofu dog, tofu dog. But everybody is crying and screaming because they can't get here, but Blake will be my heir for my late night. Uh, because I, every time I switch generations, I gotta focus on a new expansion pack because I wanna explore everything and everything that The Sims 3 has to offer. So I try my best to explore everything that I can. Sella was stuck. <laughs> Sella is the daughter of Connor's brother. So obviously Connor has a brother named Jared and Jared currently has a daughter. And apparently she is also... Oh fuck, that's weird. Oh, that is really weird. So Ava is the daughter of Galen. So t they are not related, but you know it is still kind of it, it is just a little bit weird in a way. It is she's also way older than her, so that's kind of odd. But Blake is a, has star quality. He's shy, frugal, and ambitious, and his lifetime wish will be a master mixologist. I do really want to make his imaginary friend real, but in order to do that, I believe you have to have eight skill points of logic and up which is honestly insane absolutely insane what are you gonna do listen to her oh god why do i have autonomy off then why is nobody taking care of themselves can i ask <laughs> why are you not taking care oh my god are you guys still learning how to drive where are you guys are you still here i don't think they ever went to learn how to drive did they no, I don't think so. But I really want him to discover the, like, potion, how to make imaginary friends real. Now, I believe you need level 8 and up to discover the potion, and I, it's kind of tedious. I don't really like the imaginary friends because they cause for so many, like, routing issues. It is honestly insane. It is not even funny anymore. It is honestly not funny anymore. She wants to learn Kaelin Langorak's sign, but they have no compatibility. So I think I would just let story progression do its thing and see if we can find, a, or, or if it can find a little soulmate for, for Ayla. Oh, she's already fast asleep. No, honey. No, you have a baby. You can just do that. You also still need to eat, you need to shower, see if what, what happens with this household. Nobody takes care of themselves. They're still spoiled cereal. All the tofu do dogs have already been eaten. You can just have some canned soup, I guess. A microwave meal, sure. Now, considering that I have already been uh, recording for 50 minutes. Look at him. Look at this fucking guy. But considering that I've already been recording this for 50 minutes, I still need to edit this. I will wrap up this current household here. I will do an update of this family every month or so. So stay tuned for that. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it wasn't too chaotic. I know this household is a mess. I haven't even introduced the pets, but you know, everything will. You can also follow my, my Tumblr. It is always linked in the description because I do almost weekly updates of this family on there so 
definitely check that out and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys! Thank you.